Hello. Sorry about the last video. I was angry. This is me in my Lincoln Town car. Yeah. This place is so cool. They just, they won't even get mad at me because I'm here every day. They know I'm going to buy something. Hopefully by the end of next week. Hopefully tomorrow. I just don't want any favors. I don't want government money. Guys, look. Beautiful woman, no a man. He's vaping. I just love when they don't even bother. They're like, here, that's magical. We got locks. It's electronic, but not. All the lights make sense. They're right there. Uh, whatever the wind does, it's okay. What is that? I thought it said think. Oh, it's trunk. You can pop your trunk at the airport. Still got a CD player, JVC. Something like genuine vinyl quality. I don't know. What, that's not what that means. QVC. My grandma watched that. Whatever. What is all this stuff? It had a message center before anybody. I guarantee you, like, Tom Cruise was probably driving one of these back in 2002. No, some rapper was, like, singing about being in his Lincoln Town Car executive series, and now they're like, well, what's up? Looks like my bundles, as Cam says. No. I'm talking to black girls, and I'm like, that stuff is so expensive. I thought you guys were saving money, and they're like, as it, well, you have to take care of it a lot and you have to replace it and they're like, I'm like why don't you just go afro but I don't say that I don't say that because they're stressed out they have angry black girl disease look at Ocelot he has to sit in the seat that's a little bit messed up my seat is not which is why what was going what's going on in the passenger seat I'm not on my period what's going on that this seat's in perfect shape this person, the man, was just like this. That's his elbow right there. Billy Page. And I don't know what she was doing. The female ocelot. As I do, there's a lot of room right there. There's a lot more room than my car, and you can probably push it back. I push it with automatic. It's not. That's okay. That's okay. What, I'm by automatic. I meant manual, which is the opposite of what I meant. Hi, guys. Well, Dennis can sit there because he's probably going to cut something by accident with his Cutco knife. Don't worry, Kyle. You don't have to come. We can put that down and separate Michael and Dennis while they're trying to kill Ocelot. Michael's going to be trying to kill me. The way he's going to do it is by... He's going to realize he has to flirt with me, vomit at night. That will make Dennis angry enough that Ocelot will have to kill both of them. To put them out of their misery, and then we'll have an empty back seat, more room for us, right? It's so cute. Our car seat's gonna look so cute back there. Kitty okay, cat. And all yours. All this for zero dollars. Taco Bell packets are free. And I will pay the, well, it's gonna be more than that tax title and license plus insurance. Am I going to insure it? Oh, fuck yeah. And I'm gonna get. Stalker insurance on it. Scientology insurance. I'm going to say, how much does that cost? They'll be like, what you just described is why the tow truck companies hung up on me. I'm figuring it out. They did not want the drama. They were like, we got Rex and Lufkin. We don't have time for this. And they hung up on me. And I shouldn't have told them anything. I should have just said, can you move my car? Or bring me some gas? It didn't occur to me. I just I told them. 15 minutes of telling them about personalitycafe.com or my vertical scope out of Toronto. Probably gonna be like six, less than 6,500. It's so comfortable in here. That CD player is the deal maker. The heartbreaker, the deal. You know what I decided? I just, not Ryan Adams, too much drama. I thought it makes the most sense, and I'm like, yeah, but you like his music too much. Isn't that a weird thing to say? I'd rather not know anything about somebody. Well, like the way all of Orlando Bloom is with Catherine. Isn't that cool? If the whole world was obsessed with you, and you didn't have to talk about it, the whole world's not obsessed with Ryan Adams. He wishes. And that's what's going to happen. He's going to use me. Never. Connor Obers wouldn't use me. No. Nobody in that friend group. 
because that's what I do in friend groups. I need somebody with no friends. Guess who that is? Tom Cruise. He has no friends. <laughs> Why? Because he doesn't like people. Oh, I am not kidding. He doesn't like people in the way that Thomas Merton didn't like people. You are not invited to our super secret wedding at Gethsemane. I'm not kidding. It'll be super secret. It's going to be in Thomas Merton's hermitage. You are not invited. We're going to go down to the lake and smoke a cigarette. He's not. I'm going to smoke a cigarette. Probably several. We're going to find wherever Thomas Merton had anything in there. Probably a time machine. Probably I hit something in there for myself to find that says, congratulations, you did it. I think I hit that in there in 2014 or 15. It's going to say, way to go, only seven years, bruh. But I wouldn't have written that. I didn't say bruh back then. It's going to say, it's going to be tears. It's going to say, are you a raccoon? Yeah, that was my plan, was to shop as a raccoon over there. Be like, better Anne-Marie of the past. So much better. You did not have to become a raccoon in the astral realm. You married Tom Cruise. And I would be like, I'd be out there in my garden like, that makes less sense to me than becoming a raccoon in the astral realm. I've seen Gardens of the Galaxy. Didn't like it. Did not like it. Chris Pratt is not. He's not. Aren't you, aren't you glad that I let you know who's hot or not? Come on, people. It's easy. Jake Gyllenhaal. Hot. Ryan Reynolds. Hot. Christian Braille. Braille. <laughs> Christian Braille. Christian Bale. Hot. Christian Slater. Hot. <coughs> Tom Hanks. Not hot. Never hot. Nope. Dustin Hoffman. That's that category. Bill Murray. Dana Carvey. <laughs> Martin Short. Luckily, they would think that was funny. Suddenly, it smells like coffee in here. I wonder if I sat in here, would they, they would be like, nah, they think they don't know anything about my life up here, except for what I choose to tell them. They're going to be like, did you sleep in that car? I'm going to be like, no. I made a video about buying it. Look, if they didn't want me in here, they wouldn't have left the back door open so I could reach and open the front. Wait to do this. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yes, yes. Oh, it's gonna break the car. It's gonna break up. It's exactly what Shake Sula would do. Turning into Shake Sula. You'd be like, what the <laughs> Officer Lopez was just like, did she just get out of that car? Is that illegal? I'm calling Peppers. Every time I think that's a real person. Guys, I am so happy that's not an ocelot head or a jaguar head. I don't want this car. Buy it. You can have it. Now, this car is too sensible. 2006. It costs more than that. But it is a 2006. And it has fabric seats. Everybody knows I prefer fabric seats because you can burn holes in them better. And they're not hot if your AC goes out. And it's a Nissan. Oh, fuck. God damn it. It's gonna be impractical for me. Isn't that weird? That's gonna make me cry. What is wrong with me? Somebody could tell me your kids are kidnapped by the Scientologists. I wouldn't cry. I'd say, I told you so. I hope they remember everything I taught them. I wouldn't cry at all. I am so done crying about my family. I just laugh my head off. I'm like, hey, get what you get. You deserve everything you get, all of you, including the children. I'm like, Sydney deserves it. Bobby and JG deserve it. Grow up, bro. My sisters are fond of saying, he's a genius, she's a genius. I'm like, well, genius, get it together. You're gonna end up like your parents. Maybe they're geniuses, maybe they're retarded. There's a very thin line. 06, wait, it's the most expensive of the bunch. Definitely inconspicuous, I like that. old enough to be, well, you can always tell the nice cars, they don't lock them, I mean, they do lock them. Wait a second, it makes sense. God, these guys are smart. 
Ultima. Ultimate. That's a pretty big trunk. I liked my hatchback. I could fit so much bullshit in there, guys. Wow, that must be the nicest car they have right now. Isn't that weird? Why don't they put the mileage on it? I don't know what, it's just faded. It's only been out here for a hot minute, but it's already faded, so you can't read the VIN. This is the most expensive thing here, other than the Hummer. Yeah, I don't need a Lincoln Town car. If I get a white car, I told Christian back in the day before I tried to kill myself every day for two years. I'd never do that. Gas mileage, yikes. Let's check out the tires. Sweet. I guarantee you the person who gave them this car, sold them this car, was like, don't want her in there. Get, they're gonna buy their car back. They're gonna be like, no, no, no. No, sir, no. <laughs> Tyler's gonna be like, he sold it to us. He gave it to us. Somebody died. They're like, yes, she had a heart attack because of her, that woman. You can't sell that car. She's trying to ruin that Kadocha. No, those people don't own Nissan Ultimates. It's special. It's a special edition, special ed edition. I like those lights, they're pretty cool. Okay, it's gonna say just married to Tom Cruise. <laughs> Regardless of who Ocelot is. It's gonna say, just married to Elon Musk and Tom. <laughs> and he's just gonna be some guy, some asshole. Some asshole, and I'm gonna force him to drive that! William Martin, don't worry, I thought they sold it. <laughs> they didn't, guys. It's still here. All of our wildest dreams can still come true, William. <laughs> I know you want to hang out with your friends and have a cool, super cool wedding. Sorry if it has to be because I turned down Tom Cruise for you and we buy this. Tom Cruise buys us this. I can't believe G&G &G did this locks on here. Of course they did. It's probably made here. What the? This was not here the other day. What? Why would you buy that Hummer when you can buy this and it probably uses the same amount of gas and you also don't have to go anywhere? <sighs> okay. Elon, Tom Cruise, get together, Katy Perry, Orlando Bloom. Get out your wallets. You don't have cash. Just buy this for me. Leave it here. Don't take it to Beaumont. Wow. Whoa. Oh, I like that. Oh, there you go. There you go, William. Mm, it pops out. When we drive down the road, guys, we're going to be so famous that we're just going to leave it out. Fredo Silva is going to have to get a bunch of bikes and stuff around, stuffs around us. <laughs> Wide load. I have to, if, look, if I have to drive around those assholes, then you, then everybody's drive around. I like this Nissan better, but it is, whoa, it is an automatic? What the? I don't want to compete with Lizzie. Did I say a Nissan? Oh, no. That's why William makes fun of me. A Nissan S10, it's like the other day in Colonial Hills. I know you caught that, you idiots. All my ex-boyfriends are mechanics or pretend mechanics, William. Just because you're an aerial land surveyor doesn't mean you don't have a fixture truck. Well, it's not that out of date. You see how fast I changed my mind? Don't worry, don't do soon. Those are slightly better tires. Would it pass inspection? According to William. Now I became William Duncan. It's sad, now I don't need him anymore. Look at me. Now you learn how to fish. Now I have this. S10, which is not a Nissan. Why do I keep saying it's a Nissan in my brain? It's already got toolbox. Amory, has it ever occurred to you that somebody already bought it and that's why it's up here? It's exactly, um, Amory, stop it. I'm like, it's almost exactly like my dad's Nissan. Not a Nissan. That's a Nissan. <laughs> We're getting closer. Uh -oh. Some mold on it. Luckily, that washes off. Ooh. Uh oh. Yeah. I thought that door came off of it. Uh oh. Who who keyed my car? Who scraped off the paint? There's a little shirt in there. I can't fit anybody in here with me. Just a body in the back. Oh no. Why are the coolest... I understand. The coolest 
coolest cars are oh, always standards. But Cardi B can't drive. Why do I have to know how to drive? I could drive that, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to park it in. Ow, Galveston. Can't wait for Tyler to show up and be like, hi, you're up early. And I'm saying, I need to go to Rodeo. Yeah, this car is pretty much more my style. Yeah. <sighs> As Tom Cruise is a terrible thing when you cannot escape yourself, when you know exactly who you are. I met this guy on eHarmony last night, it was a new profile, whatever. He, well, he wrote me, and he's gonna watch this, and he's gonna be like, oh, what? And I was just like, ah, sure, whatever, I talk to everybody. eHarmony is way safer than Facebook, people. Facebook, that's, you accidentally join a, you can't tell, you don't know where the pervs are gonna come from, and they're all, sorry, I hate to say it, but they're all Egyptian, Pakistani. I hate to say it, they're Muslim, they're not Christian. Or they're nothing at all. It's not, I'm really sorry. That's not racist. That's not anything against Islam. I'm just saying that's kind of a pervy religion. It's not really, and it's like Christianity is not a violent religion, but it is. Judaism, they're not trying to take over the world. You know what I mean? Wink, wink. If this car is locked. <laughs> I like cars that have smog emissions on them. It's like, this is the extent to which you can destroy the earth. You know you can, I mean, wait a second. Oh, those are some funked up tires, but at least they're huge. I think they would pass them just because they'd be like, whatever. Man, 2002. I, I thought the color was while. While away the hours in here. Uh, 130,000, that's the same as my Civic. It's Susu. It's a Japanese. Is it Japanese, Chinese, who knows, who cares? Wow. Hey, it's got a rack for all my cool luggage that I buy at TJ Maxx. Blend the fog and bullshit. It's already funked up in there. Everybody knows I prefer fabric seats and we can really all just be far away from each other in here. It's pre-contaminated apparently. Yes, this is much more my style. You know why? Because I can live in it, drive it, parallel park it. Mm, doesn't, it's not a stupid Chevy Suburban or whatever. Look at that, you could sleep back there. That's what my dad would do. But he would also chop shop it. He leases brand new cars and immediately turns it into that. I'm not kidding, you should see the car he drives right now. I knew he was depressed when I got in and it wasn't perfectly OCD'd clean. I was like, what? He's eating fast food and it's all over the floor. And they put me with him and I'm suicidally depressed and he's just smoking weed and eating McDonald's or whatever. See, he wouldn't get this. He would get that Nissan Altima, that's what he has or something like that. And then he cuts, he takes it somewhere and he pays them to cut the seats out. He doesn't own it. It doesn't matter if he's paid one payment on it. He has them cut the seats out. He just says, keep them. And then he walks off and his, his outfit I've described to you. He just like uh, camps his way to somewhere. I wish he would do that right now. I bet you this pops open. Uh, looks like somebody got it with electrical tape. That's fine. Exterior lock with a real human key, bro. But unfortunately, it does not work. <laughs> and I guarantee you it does not wait to pop it. Hey, McAllen, I like that dealership. That's where my Honda came from. So many people on motorcycles these days. These tires are, hey, whoa, sweet. At least the rear tires are good. 
those are gonna be some expensive tires. Why? Oh, unevenly worn people, that's not a good sign. Let me tell you something, on our Honda Odyssey we had some, was one stupid part that cost a zillion dollars. God, we had to buy new tires all the time. That is really bad. I wonder all these bolts, is that supposed to be an antenna? Sorry, we got a smashed windshield, pre-smashed, whatever. Nisha might will replace that if I pretend it happened. <laughs> as soon as I pull out of here, I'm gonna have somebody throw a rock at it, and then I'm gonna call Nation White and say, You're not gonna believe this. They're gonna say, We do your life is really bad right now, isn't it? Just don't ask Peppers, because they'll be like, It was already like that. I think they'd lie for me. There's no price on this. Okay, that makes the most sense. Don't like these giant cars, they're auctioning. That I can't drive. That's awesome. Plus, that's my god number in case you're Juniper. Fuck you. 1279. If the, if I check my email right now and the psychics say, Yes, did you buy a car? And I'll be like, No, did you grow up? And it has a toolbox. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. First place, second place, future. Future. No, I don't like these cars. I can't be here. I'll park them. Ah, uh, no. Too stupid, the rendezvous. No, I don't want to rendezvous with you. No, too much gas. Yes, because Lizzie. No, no, because I have to replace everything on it. Brakes and all that bullshit. Hate Tahoes. Pontiac, maybe. No, no. Well, wait a second. What? Five or an eight. Oh, but it has a zillion miles. Okay, yes. All right. So we're gonna say one, two. I don't even know if that's for sale. I uh, just take the Toyota off of there. One, two, three. That's the Nissan. That's four. Somebody they sold my Blazer because I talked about it. That's a V6. Six. Four cylinder or V8. Uh, scary. It's a lot of miles. Grand Prix. <laughs> Wait a second. This is five thousand nine ninety five, and it dropped to four thousand nine ninety five. Maybe I can get the drop to three thousand nine ninety five. And it's open. Good sign. Oh my gosh. I do feel sexy getting in here. This is kind of like Moses' car. When you see me with Moses, we look so fancy, but but if you get on the inside, it's pretty. It smells nice in here. It's got a fucking sunroof. What the? Oh God, I need a car. Please help me, Jesus. Where's my battery now? Uh oh, <laughs> the seat doesn't go back up. I love it. It's old. Yes. Oh my god. Manual seats, yes. No, this probably isn't manual. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. It's not manual. Well, whatever, who cares? I got a little screen here. I don't know what it does. I could turn off your passenger airbag so you'll die. I won't because you're much more likely to get hurt. I don't get in wrecks. Wow, you, I will blow you with that air conditioner. Four. Uh, that looks like something in a planetarium. Elon Musk is gonna appreciate that. I'll be like, I am hot. I'll be like, you are not hot. Elon Musk is not hot. I, you know what I'm in love with? I was gonna say his brain, but I think, here we go again, his audacity. I hate that word now. I'm not kidding, this is how enlightenment works. God uses what you love the most to ruin what you actually love more. So he's using men to ruin music for me and everything else. I never cared about cars before, so this is new. I think the way we're gonna ruin this is just by dying in it. Sweet, this makes me think of Cars, Pixar movie that you may have heard of. Look how simple those gauges are. It's like a race car driver. I'm sure Elon Musk is like 140 miles an hour. Somebody put this bitch on a bullet train through the Atlantic Ocean. Like, how about you just shoot me into space, you idiot? 
Once you find that girl, here's my tweet. When the twats tweet on Twitter, you find a babysitter. She's probably in shed, and I hope she's not yet dead. Control the volume. I'll just shut up. Is that a CD? Goes in there. Oh. Oh my god, wait a second, I was still making a video. I guess now you know I actually am super religious.